shit with the she was trying to eat corn and it got caught in her hair. Dude, now yeah. she's like a big bald pot. She's got to my green. Oh, hey, I'm Alex Drummond. And I'm. This is MSPN two. Two. It's Will Dwelly with me. And this is Alex Drummond, Drummond, and I'm Will Dwelly. Will Dwelly. Folks, we have a plethora of stories for you today. A ton. First off, Timothy Bradley, famous U.S. American badminton player, saved the cat off from a tree. An old lady's cat in his neighborhood. A good Samaritan saw a cat stuck in the tree and was like, hey, I'm going to save that cat for this old lady. She saw him crying. Great guy. We I'll, met him before. I'll tell you, man. He may play bad mitten, but today he saved a good kitten. Let's see how he did it. Here, kitty, kitty! And we're back. Man, he's a great guy. Great guy. Next, Next up, made a fantastic character. we have Sean Johnson. Sean Johnson. He is a ping pong maestro. Also one of kind. Oh man, the yeah, way he man. works that paddle is incredible. I've never seen. It's like he's like he is at uh, currently at the TJ Maxx Maximum Overdrive Invitational, just tearing it up. Guys, technique is flawless. Let's uh, see how he does it. Beethoven. Hello, I'm here with Sean Johnson at the TJ Maxx Maximum Overdrive Invitational. So, how do you think you did? I mean. I do what I always do, I just win. That's pretty much all there is to it. You know, I got big red here. Had it since I was a boy. Explain, because there's two colors, not just red. I mean, red is all that matters. There's blue, but there's not, though. Impressive. All right, next up, we have, uh, we have William Jackson. Mm, William Jackson, he yeah. is a firecracker. Firecracker at Tic Tac Toe, ladies Three and gentlemen. Three in Tic Tac Toe. Bro. Bang, bang, boom. That's his strategy. And, you know, most players, they use pencil. Not, not him. He uses Sharpie. Sharpie. And you know what? He uh, dominated this week at uh, the MacArthur in memoriam, uh, this tournament in memoriam of uh, Coach Basil. Mm -hmm. You know, his absence really let the hole, so we yeah. threw a tournament in his, uh, his name. Of course. Let's go see the highlights from uh, this tic-tac-toe tournament. Well, here it is, folks. We're going into his final move. Oh! <laughs> Howdy, folks. Welcome to the Coach Base Memorial Invitational Tic-tac-toe tournament. We're here with the champion. How do you feel about that victory? You know, uh, I just really want to give out, you know, it's about my Native Americanism, all right? You know, they believe that if you go out and hunt your own wool and skin your own leather, that you'll do well. And when you compete, you know, bring out your animal spirit. I don't want to brag, but I consider myself a falcon today. Going into that final victory, as you're about to put down that last X, what was going through your mind? No comment. Well, there you have it, folks. The champion himself. I just want to say thank you. Back to you. Gosh, man, these kids never fail to amaze me. I'm sure Coach Basil is looking down and just loving the view. Yep. Well, it's great. I love spending time with you guys. You know, it's a great time. I love telling stories. It's what I do. You ask my wife. You know, I tell stories every. Like I just, I'll, I don't even know I'll where I'm at sometimes. Wife. That's for sure. Okay. So uh, meet us back again at uh, next week. That's personal. And uh, we'll see you. Love you. Hey, yeah, MSPN too. No. Sean's a great woman. <laughs>